Hello and welcome to Thursday Thoughts. My name is Amanda McDonald and I'm a member here at Key Street Ministries. Today I want to talk to you about new beginnings. Life is full of new beginnings. New beginnings can be exciting, such as a wedding, a new baby, a job promotion. These are things in life that we are so excited to start something and do something new. New beginnings can also be hard, unwanted, and scary. These are things like um, the loss of a job, the death of a loved one, or a scary diagnosis. These are times you didn't choose a new beginning, but you're faced with one anyway. Sometimes you may desire a new beginning, but you don't know if you can start again. Maybe you had a disagreement with your spouse or a friend and you're not sure how to say you're sorry. Or maybe you lied to your parent and you're not sure how to face them and tell the truth. You may even feel like you've waited too long. Is it too late to say something? Is it too late to have a new beginning? Today, I wanna to tell you that it's never too late with God to have a new beginning. And I wanna show you a couple exam examples from the Bible. I wanna start with Abraham and Sarah. Abraham and Sarah were in their 90s and Sarah desperately wanted a child, but she had not been able to have a child. She thought that she was far long from being able to have children in her 90s. But by a miracle, she conceived a child and had a baby. Abraham and Sarah tell me it is never too late for a new beginning. King David in the Old Testament is one of the most interesting people in the Bible to me. He's known as a murderer and an adulterer. But when I think of a phrase to describe King David, I think of a man after God's own heart. That's what's said about David in the Bible, even though he was a murderer and an adulterer. King David teaches me that my past doesn't dictate whether I can leave a worthy legacy. The next person is Saul slash Paul. Saul was hunting down Christians after Jesus um, was crucified and rose again. He felt like this was not a true story and he wanted to get rid of this Christian faith. He thought it was heresy and he had an encounter with God. And he became one of the most powerful people in the movement for Christianity. Paul teaches me that it doesn't necessarily matter about my past. The old life is gone and a new life can start again and it's worthy of a new beginning. The prodigal son is one of my favorite stories. In this story, the prodigal son leaves his family dishonorably, takes his inheritance and runs away. He spends all his money, ends up in a pig pen and realizes, you know what? This is really bad. I'd be better off being a slave at my dad's house than I would be living in this slop. He had to find a way to go home and tell his family that he was sorry for what he did. And what ended up happening is his dad embraced him completely and brought him home not as a slave, but as a son. The prodigal son teaches me that it's never too late to say you're sorry, to ask for forgiveness, and come home. 2 Corinthians 5.17 says, Anyone who belongs to Christ has become a new person. The old life is gone and a new life has begun. Isaiah 43, 18 through 19 says, But forget all that. It is nothing compared to what I'm going to do, for I am about to do something new. See, I have already begun. Do you not see it? God is ready to do something new for you. At my house, my husband has a motto that we have hanging on the wall. And it says, it doesn't matter how or where you start, it's about how you finish. You see, he's a runner. So when he starts a race, sometimes you don't have a great start, but it's all about how you finish the race that matters. So it may not be how you start or, how, or where you start in the race, it's all about how you choose to finish. This week, consider ways that you need a new beginning in your life. Maybe you need a hard restart. Maybe you need to say, I'm sorry, or maybe you need to come home. Maybe you need to ask God for forgiveness and ask for a new beginning. Remember, it's never too late. Have a great week.